Uh, so my name is Charlotte. Uh, I'm head of relationships at Lempire. Uh, we're just starting the department. So basically our goal or our overall mission at Lempire is to help people and businesses grow. And um, in our opinion, business is really all about relationships. So the relationships that you build with um, really everyone around you, partners, influencers, co-founders, etc. So yeah, that's uh, basically my arrow. <laughs> Okay, um, so Lemlist is really a self sales prospecting tool. So basically, um, companies use it to find their new clients. Um, and uh, so the goal is to build new relationships and to uh, yeah, uh, grow your company. Um, as for tools that we use internally to build our culture, uh, because we're a hybrid company, so we're half remote, half on site here in our, in our offices, um, we use Slack, but we also have an internal tool called Lemverse, which is um, a little metaverse, a little virtual office where everyone has a small little avatar and can run around. And basically when you walk up closely to somebody, it launches a video call. Um, and, uh, and yeah, so we have all of our meetings on there, uh, all of our one-to-one -one communication. When writing a message on Slack isn't, uh, yeah, just doesn't do it, then we, we always have our communication on Lemverse. And I think it, it really adds to our culture and it makes the relationships between, um, yeah, colleagues that are on site, for example, and remote, much, uh, much more uh, rich and, uh, and yeah, nicer. The tool influences the culture. Um, I think uh, every tool is a representation of a company culture. I think um, every tool should uh, represent the identity of your brand or of your company, because otherwise. What's the point? <laughs> Otherwise, I think it's really hard for people to identify themselves with you, your brand, and to actually uh, find authenticity in your product and to trust you uh, as, a, as a provider or a collaborator. Yeah. Um, so the changes that were brought about by the introduction of yeah. our tool, yeah. our communications tool, okay, I think... Um, I think, yeah, when we launched Lemvers internally, um, I'm going to talk more about Lemvers because I think yeah. Lemlist is not really uh, bringing us together as a company. It's our main product, sure. but um, uh, not really for internal communication. I think uh, ever since we've launched Lemvers um, internally, we are able to communicate more easily. I think uh, it reduces loneliness at the workplace because working remotely can be really lonely and frustrating. Um, so it's basically super easy to walk up to somebody and just say hi for five minutes, have a virtual coffee um, and, uh, and chat and also get to know your colleagues better even though you don't see them every day. Um, so I think the overall team spirit uh, has really greatly evolved with, uh, with numbers. And then also sometimes we simply have a question that's really important for you to be able to get your work done and uh, the barrier of contacting somebody on Slack, for example, is much higher. So just being able to walk up to somebody and ask them a question um, is just more efficient uh, than having endless conversations in Slack sometimes. So yeah, that's... Uh, this tool has remained internal or you proposed it already to some of your customers or your ecosystem? Yeah, so... Um, it's an open source tool. Okay. So basically um, everyone can create their office on it. Um, it's uh, $5 per user per month. It's really a side project of ours uh, that we're, um, but that is open to everyone. 